channel. Today I'll be doing a few more experiments in my homemade Raku kiln. We have this piece here, which is beautiful west coast black sand over various uh, reactive glazes that I'll be putting in a little reduction chamber. And then this piece here is the same copper Raku glaze, but I've added some uh, silicon carbide in it to create maybe some, some bubbles. And then inside is a white crackle glaze that I haven't got to work very well, so let's get going. Venturi burner and regulating the temperature here. I'm starting off quite low because I don't want to heat it up too fast and this kiln is so well insulated that I can get it to a thousand degrees in about 15 minutes. Once it hits 300 degrees Celsius I'll crank it up a bit. While we wait for that to heat up I'm Filling up my reduction chambers with various newspaper and some bark. Um, and then once the pieces go in, I'm hoping the round piece will actually fit in here. I didn't check, check the size, which was a bit silly. If not, oh well, we'll figure something out. Um, and then we'll just go ahead and put extra on top. Uh, you would usually put the pieces on a stack of um, burning material directly in a larger production chamber but we've used that <laughs> over here to make a little outdoor fire pit and I'm too lazy to navigate over all the benches and things so instead we're just going to put them straight in the tins and put the lid on top whereas usually I would put the pieces in there and then just flip this over on top. So we'll see how this method goes. Let's see where we're at on the pyrometer scale. So check that in. Yeah, that's about 300 degrees and it's climbing but it's climbing a bit slower. Safely turn it up so we'll crank this up and so it's now at about 600 degrees to just shut my little front port just to let it cool down 
not too fast. You can shut the top one too if you like, but I'm not going to this time. to get the <laughs> lids on um, as you can see it's still smoking a bit so not as, as snug a fit as when I put them in a sand in there and then chuck the tin over top but we'll see how they go um, not worried as always thanks for watching have a lovely Christmas or Hanukkah or just a happy holiday Kaki Te Ano